Hi and welcome back to the channel, I am your host Clifton3D. Certainly emboldened after the success of Super Mario, Nintendo has come out and announced their collaboration to create a live action adaptation of the beloved Legend of Zelda. Over here on Bounding Into Comics, thank you Spencer Belushi for this article. Nintendo officially teams with Avi Arad for live action, The Legend of Zelda film, The Rise of Skywalker screenwriter set to pen script. Let me be perfectly honest here. I'm not a fan of The Rise of Skywalker, never was, don't like it, don't care about it. I think a lot of people think the same way as I do in this regard. So I'm not entirely sure what to think about this, but Nintendo did work together with Universal and made their product and we're like, no, we want it this way. And it turned out to be awesome. So could this be awesome? Guess we're gonna see. Undoubtedly emboldened by their decision, by the recent success of their mascots, recent cinematic outing, Nintendo has officially announced that they will be teaming up with producer Avi Arad and director Wes Ball to develop a live action The Legend of Zelda film. Link's jump to the silver screen was first confirmed by Nintendo itself via a November 8th press release published to its official website. Alongside the news that said film was in development, the legendary game maker announced that the project would be produced by the Legend of Zelda series creator and esteemed Nintendo developer Shiriguri Miyamoto, as well as storied comic book movie producer Avi Arad, whose notable credits include such lauded films as Spider-Man 2 2004, Iron Man 2008, well that's good, and Sony's thus far Spider-Verse duology, as well as stinkers like X-Men The Last Stand, Morbius, and Uncharted. Now, I mean, Spider-Man 2 was pretty damn freaking awesome, and Iron Man, I absolutely loved it. A lot of people are enjoying the Spider-Verse, but uh, not so much me. But there's still the Rise of Skywalker lingering in there. It's like, I'm not sure about this, but it does sound like they will have the creator of The Legend of Zelda in on this. And I hope that they take the same approach that Oda took with One Piece with Netflix. Like, I want to sign off on absolutely everything. Elaborating on the film's creative team, Nintendo also revealed that Link's live-action adventure would be directed by Wes Ball, whose brief Hollywood filmology includes stints helming the Maze Runner trilogy of films and the soon-to-be-released Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes. Further, per deadline, Nintendo has tapped Jurassic World and Star Wars Episode IX The Rise of Skywalker screenwriter Derek Connolly to tackle the film's script. Now, I had a guilty pleasure of Jurassic World. I, I enjoy the whole new series. Not as good as, as Jurassic Park by a long shot, but I still enjoyed it for what it was. It's a guilty pleasure, but it, it wasn't great. The writing wasn't great. And The Rise of Skywalker? Abhorrent. I'm sorry. They can fly now? Wow, what script writing. Notably, Sony Pictures will also have a hand in bringing The Legend of Zelda film to fruition, as it will be co-financed by Disney and Sony Pictures Entertainment. More than 50% financed by Nintendo. As part of this partnership, Sony will also handle the film's eventual theatrical distribution. Closing out their press release, Nintendo proudly beamed by producing visual contents of Nintendo IP by itself. Nintendo is creating new opportunities to have people from around the world to access the world 
of entertainment which Nintendo has built through different means apart from its dedicated game consoles by getting deeply involved in the movie production with the aim to put smiles on everyone's faces through entertainment. The developer concluded Nintendo will continue its efforts to produce unique entertainment and deliver it to as many people as possible. And here are the tweets that Nintendo put out. This is Miyamoto. I have been working on the live action film of The Legend of Zelda for many years now with Avi Aradson, who has produced many mega hit films. I have asked Avi san to produce this film with me, and we have now officially started the development of the film with Nintendo itself heavily involved in the production, which I really do hope it will take time until its completion. But I hope you look forward to seeing it. I am certainly looking forward to this. I have hope for it. Now, I know that the script writer, I don't care for the movies that much that he's written because it's usually trash. But with the heavy involvement with Nintendo, the creator of The Legend of Zelda himself being behind this project, you know, Sony is hit or miss, but usually, you know, they come together and put out some good content. So I do have hope. I'm looking forward to this. I can't wait until we get some teasers, some trailers, more content about this. I can't wait until it comes out to watch it. Anyway, let me know down in the comments below what you think about this announcement. What do you think about The Legend of Zelda? Have you played the games? Do you know the lore better than I do, probably? Okay. So we'll see. But. At that point, I would like to say every Wednesday I try to retro game. Now, I'm not going to be playing it tonight. I, maybe not even next week, but I do plan on playing some of the Zelda games on Wednesday nights because I'm looking forward to it. And, you know, it's it's a huge, huge fan base. It's a huge IP. It sounds interesting. I want to get into the lore, so let me know what you think. Anyway, I hope you liked this video. If you did, smash that like button. Consider subscribing if you haven't already. And hey, hit the bell for notifications because YouTube doesn't know that you want to see my videos by just subscribing. Funny, huh? How that works. Anyway, until next time, take care.